Hi, my name is John Helfen, and I'm going to walk you through how to design an RC car body for the HCL 2.0 kit. To begin, what we've done is created the overall chassis and some of the internal components that you'll need in order to build the RC car body. Essentially, what you'll be doing is importing an archive file into Fusion's cloud storage and using that to build your car body around. You can do this by clicking on the data panel button in the upper left hand corner of the Fusion screen. This will expand a browser that shows you a list of projects or the current project you're viewing. As you can see, I have a project called Formula RC that I've already created. You may see something different. If you click the arrow just to the left of the title, you can return to the top level to see all the projects that you have available. Now I have many projects because I've been using Fusion for some time, but you may only see a few. You have a choice of uploading into an existing project, or you can click the new project button to start a new project. A project is essentially just a folder on the cloud storage system where you can put all your files related to this project. I'm going to go ahead and double click Formula RC because I'm going to upload my file to that location. Once you're in the project you want to upload to, you can simply click the upload button and then select files that you want to upload from your hard drive. In this case, I want to look for hcell.f3d. This is an archive file that includes the chassis and tires and other internal components that you're going to build around. I'll click open and then I can simply click upload. Once the upload is complete, you can see that I now have HCell in my data panel, and I can close the upload progress window, and I can double click on the file that was just uploaded to load that into Fusion. Once the file is loaded, you can click the X in the upper corner of the data panel to close it, giving you more room on the screen to work. We're now ready to continue on to the next step. 